You're welcome to my virtual DJ Effects Tutorial Episode 3. In today's episode, we are going to learn how to use the backspin to do transition between tracks. And that is loop, the backspin, echo and crossfader. I guess you're back. Are you gonna tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply. It's like that. You're just gonna walk. Do you remember the day we first met? It was a Sunday about two. So let's dive into it. Go to settings. Click on controllers and click on advanced editor. Now type in the key you prefer to use and type in this script. Now the action is when you press the key, it will loop the song 0.5 while we pressed and it will backspin while we pressed and this effect backspin slider one will set the backspin length to 0.48 and this echo effect will echo the song while we pressed and effect echo slider 2 will set the exo length to 0.7 so this is how it works like time that's forever now let's go to our crossfader mapping this is the mapping script for the crossfader this crossfader 50% and up question mark Crossfader 0% is used to cut off deck 2. Do you remember the day we first met? And then this crossfader 50% and up question mark crossfader 100% is used to cut off deck 1. Do you remember the day we first met? And if you want to use the crossfader as we use it in the episode 1 just check out the link in the description down below. Now let's learn how to play with the keys. So we are going to use deck 2 to mix deck 1. You can also use deck 1 to mix deck 2. And we will use our keys to end the song in deck 1. Please don't forget to give it a like. Also subscribe and turn on the notification bell. So now, click on the crossfader and the backspin together and hold on the backspin and give three clicks on the crossfader. I guess you're back. I guess you're back. Now do that three clicks on the crossfader three times. I guess you're back. Are you gonna tell me where you went? And you can do many clicks on the crossfader as you want. So now let's do our transition. We are using deck 2 to mix deck 1. And use our keys to end the song in deck 1. Please if you found this tutorial helpful, click on the like button and also subscribe to the channel. And in case you don't understand anything, leave it in the comment section. So in our next episode, we are going to learn how to use the echo effect in transition. And if you haven't watched episode 1 and 2, check the link in the description down below. Thanks for watching. See you in next episode.